We all have lots of old electronics stored in our homes. We know we should do something with them, but don't always know what or how. In Wisconsin, many electronics can't go in the trash. They can't go in the recycling bin either because facilities that process cardboard, cans, and bottles can't handle electronics. So where do they go? To start with, you bring your old TV or laptop somewhere that's specially set up to collect electronics for recycling. To find the collection site closest to you, go to the DNR's website and search eCycle. In Wisconsin, electronics manufacturers pay some of the cost of recycling, but you might still have to pay a collector to take some of your stuff, especially TVs, to help cover the cost of proper handling. Collectors sort and package electronics and ship them to a recycling plant designed to take apart this complicated stuff safely. At this plant here in Wisconsin, workers unload electronics and weigh and inventory each pallet or container. Tracking helps make sure electronics are handled responsibly. The e-waste stream can be decades behind what's in stores today. Many older electronics are bulky and contain hazardous materials like lead or mercury, so they require extra time and care to keep workers safe and prevent pollution. After the electronics have been checked in, workers begin to pull them apart. Every recycler does this differently. Here, workers remove fasteners and screws to pull out items that can be directly reused in new electronics, like speakers and fans, or items that need special treatment, like batteries, toner cartridges, and hard drives. After these items are removed, electronics are manually dismantled or put through a shredder or other automated system. Cathode ray tubes and hard drives take a detour. Cathode ray tubes from old TVs and monitors contain leaded glass and must be handled carefully to avoid harming workers or polluting the environment. This recycler separates and cleans the leaded and non-leaded portions of the glass tubes and sends them to appropriate recycling and reuse outlets. Responsible recyclers have a defined process for handling hard drives and other data-bearing devices. This process ensures that data is completely destroyed within the recycler's facility. Once all preparation is done, High-tech recyclers use crushing and shredding machines to break electronics into small pieces. That makes the hundreds of different materials inside a device easier to sort and separate. Sophisticated machines sort shredded materials into different categories. Magnets separate pieces with iron in them. Blowers remove lighter items. Eddy currents and shakers divide other materials. At the end of this process, plastics, steel, aluminum, circuit boards, copper, and glass are ready to leave the facility. These commodities are shipped around the world for further refining before being made into something new. When you eCycle, you help reuse valuable resources and help keep our planet healthy and clean. Brought to you by eCycle Wisconsin and the Wisconsin DNR. Visit our website and search eCycle to learn more.